What's happening, everybody? Nick from Old Hair, just enjoying a nice, I guess you could say pleasant evening. I'm down here in Birmingham, uh, ran my girlfriend down to see a friend of hers. So I'm just kicking it, relaxing. It's been a pretty fun, but hey, productive day, and that's that's what it's all about in this business. Guys, I want to have a rant here, okay? And I'm going to look at you when I say this. What are some people thinking? Okay, I spent probably a good three hours today. I did a little overtime work, right? Spent three hours today talking to people on Facebook, just kind of interacting. Uh, I wanted to get a feel of what people do. I wanted to find out what people are into. Uh, what makes them motivate you know, themselves to be in the online industry? So I went in and asked some questions. Uh, there's particularly this one lady I spoke to in Wake Up Now today that, uh, man, she wouldn't even listen to me. All I tried to do was ask her some questions, and I gave her some advice about her pitching her business to me. And you know what I got out of that? I got blocked. I got a, an OMG and then a block. And it's on my page. How silly is that? I said, hey, this is something that would help you, blah, 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 blah. Two seconds later, OMG, Facebook blocked. What the heck? Now, I know it's not like a little 16-year-old girl talking like this, but I can't believe it. It was silly, you know? Then I talked to another guy today who is actually in the same business that I'm in, but he's trying to pitch me on another business. And I asked him, well, man, why aren't you focusing your efforts on you know, just one? Why not focus 110% on it and succeed in it if you're doing so well with it like he claimed to be? Which, by the way, he basically begged me to join his business you know, because of how much of a quote-unquote leader I was that he said I was. You know, which I know I am. I honestly believe that I am someone's help. You know, I can help someone out in some way, shape, or form. But this guy pitched his business to me and didn't even bother to get to know me. He just said, oh, you're in a power too? Well, let's move on to the next thing. Okay, I'm going to stop right there, and I'm going to make a little bit of a rant here, okay? First and foremost, if you want to know about Facebook marketing, I've learned quite a bit. And I want to help you with it. What I've learned is three simple things. One, people don't want to join businesses. They want to join you. They want to know what you do. They want to talk to you. That's you, the person watching this video. Okay? So don't go shooting your links to someone that you have no freaking clue who they are. And all that you know about them is that you read that they're, uh, I don't know, they like a certain book. Or they live in a certain place. If that's all you know about someone... Don't pitch your business. Connect with them. Talk to them. Okay? Second of all, all you really are looking for when you're connecting with people on Facebook is you're looking for a response. You're looking for someone and you're asking yourself with that response, how can I help this person? That's all you're going to ask. You're not going to ask, how can I get them to buy products for me? How can I get them to sign up for the $100 inner circle or the uh, $500 Costa Rica or whatever. I don't ask myself that. All I do is say, look, I got something that's going to help you. And that's even if we get to the business talk. I don't like to jump there. I like to ask what they do. I asked a guy today where he's from because I had no idea. I looked at his thing and it didn't say anything. So the first thing I said was, hey, hey, I think his name is Jerome. Hey, Jerome, how's it going? My name's Nick. I'm in this industry uh, just like you. That's awesome. Let's connect sometime. Where are you from, bud? How's your day going? That's it. I was just connecting with him. That's all it takes, guys. Just taking a little bit of time to connect with someone and just being a friend to them. Look at someone on Facebook like it's someone you're talking to on the street. You don't go up to somebody on the street and say, hey, hey, you want to make some money? You want to buy my $100 product? Who do you do that to? But seriously, what guy at the bar or girl at the bar or at the restaurant or wherever you're at do you walk up to and do that? That's ridiculous. So I'm going to call you guys out on that. And I'm going to say, for those of you that do it, stop. For those of you that don't do it, great job. You know better. And I'm proud of you. And chances are you're making money. So that's great. So just change your mindset. Change the way that you do things. Try something different. Oh, and one more thing. If you're not willing to learn something new, you're in the wrong freaking business, okay? Every day I learn something new, whether it be some crazy piece of advice or an audio that I listened to that I had a profound change on something that I was doing that I switched 
from not doing. Today, I learned something from an amazing guy, Tony Rush. I don't know if you know about this guy. He's got a million dollar ring sitting on his finger right now. And I learned something from him that I'm not in the business to enable people. I'm not you know, here to entitle myself or anyone in this business to something we don't own. I'm here to empower people. I'm here to empower someone just like you. I believe in people like you. If you're watching this video right now, I believe in you. I believe that you have the ability. You have what it takes to become a success story and a successful person. And in anything you do in life, it doesn't matter if you're with Empower Network. It doesn't matter if you're with Wake Up Now or God, United Wealth, whatever you're in. It does not matter. What matters to me is that I believe that no matter what you do, you can be successful. So put your own mind to it and believe it, and it will start to change. It doesn't matter what you think you believe. Just believe in yourself. Have that 110% confidence and go in every day with a clear goal and a clear mindset and you will discover how powerful you really are. So that's my rant for tonight. My name is Nick Fromhold and if you want to discover how to empower yourself, get in touch with me. I'll show you how. I'll give you the exact system that I've used to change my life from being you know, working 70 hours a week at a furniture moving company down to less than 15 to 20 at most a week, sitting on my butt behind a laptop, listening to amazing leaders, following their advice, and seeing results, seeing a full-time income come in. That's awesome. I'm talking your life can change in an instant. And if you're ready to make that instant change, you know who to come to. My name is Nick Frommold again. Connect with me, add me as a friend, and PM me, and let's chat. Talk to you guys soon.